But today I'm going to be building a small version of one of these, a slate or clap. So things I'm going to need. I'm going to need some type of surface. I'm going to see if there's a frosted plexiglass here. Uh, I'm going to need wood for the flat part, some type of hinge, and screws. So one of the things also I want to do with this this little uh, slate is I want to be able to like clip it onto a belt. So what I'm going to do is get something like this, and then I'm going to get a little ring. All right, so I've been wandering around Lowe's, got stuff. Guy over by the the plexiglass helped me out. He uh, cut me two pieces because that's how big it's going to be uh, for for free, just to use their scrap. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this wood. And it's going to go like this. On top, sit on top. See? And I'm going to cut this and create a hinge. These little L brackets to slam it down. I got hardware. Got little rings. <sighs> when in lose daytime. Coming outside at dusk. Got a goddamn splinter. Ain't that some shit? And I tried pulling it out and it just start breaking apart. I got a little kit I keep in my car for occasions like this. Oh shit. Ah. I don't know if you can see that thing. It hurt. So the first thing I did is I took this sh one of these sharp right angles that's going to be at the bottom. And I just used a file and filed it down. And then I put the file on the edges. The second thing I just did was I cut the little right angle pieces of wood. So as you see, this is basically what my slate's going to look like. I'm going I'm to do something about the glass. But basically this is it and, you know, like that. All right, so I've drilled, drilled some holes into the wood. Made the other. I had to drill a new hole for the top, the top of it. So now it kind of opens, you see, and it, but it binds up right here. So I just got to cut off a little bit of wood. I mean, I could just leave it and do that, but you know. So I'm gonna cut off, a, take it off, and cut off a little bit of that bottom. So here it is currently. I added a little. A D ring, so you can hook that to your pants pocket, and it opens and closes. I'm gonna paint this white, dry it, let it dry, and then put stripes on it with tape and paint this black. And then I'm gonna paint the back of this white, so when you write on it, you can see the letters. For tonight, while the white paint dries. All right, so now that it's white, I've taped where I want the white to stay. And then I'm going to paint over all this with black, so I'll have white stripes and an arrow design like you see on most. You can see the slate has been done and it's finished. Painted the back of the glass white, and then on the front I added uh, paint lines and a little bit of writing just to help separate the areas for writing scenes and takes, just to make it easier. So the reason I made this was I couldn't find a cheap, small slate online. The ones I did find were chalk slates. Uh, and they're mostly like the kind you would put in like on a shelf. They're really designed to be used. And the small slates that I did find were really small and they had no clapper on them. They were like insert uh, slates like for visual effects, things like that. So I just wanted to make one that I could small with a little clip on that you can put on your belt. And I succeeded. It. it works. So, booyah. Anyway, let me know what you think in the comments below. <laughs>